Hello guys, welcome back to Pause and welcome back to our Studio Park build. This is episode number 10 and in today's episode we are finishing off the Backlot Tram Tour. So also, off camera, we've made a few changes to the entrance plaza, added more details to the buildings and put in this nice entrance pathway. So, let's start off this video by checking out what we've done off camera. So the first thing that we've done is added a few more details to these entrance buildings as they were looking a little bit boring. So we've added some actual decals to the uh, to the uh, walls and added a new roof piece on the top. Same goes for the uh, camera supply store over here. Again, a few extra details on the inside and the outside. Just there. And we've also added this new uh, wooden roofing piece just up here. So the other thing that we've done is done a little bit of work on this main street um, so the pathway down towards the Batlot Tour we've added some trees and planters and some benches and bins just there and then the other thing over here towards the left hand side and the exit to the Hollywood Tour ride we've added another little street with some uh, planters um, just down here we've done some more buildings and fake facades here just these are basically just covering up the the queue line building of the ride and then down here we've added a new toilet block and also just themed the end uh, the exit of the hollywood ride with the billboards that we've done in the queue so that's what we've done so far guys let's like say we've added these little details just here to make this a little bit more realistic and just to add some uh depth to this side of the park uh, across this way will lead off into another section of the park which is going to be over here so that's something for the future uh, as obviously uh, we were doing work last time we've got the battle lot tour over here to finish off the store over here to finish off uh, and then eventually we'll get started on the back to the future dark ride which is going to be over this location of the park so let's get on with today's video and get started with a time lapse finishing off the Batlot Tram Tour. <laughs>
Okay, so the final scene of the ride is now complete. So let's take a look at Lockjaw's Revenge, the scene. So it starts out with this lovely pirate theme just over here. And we've got the big galleon ship just in the water. Where a huge pirate battle is taking place. So we've got some pirates on the boat and some on the shoreline and this big battle scene is playing out just here. To the other side we've got a little pirate town, a little village. So again this is a, a recreation of a scene from the movie. Remember it's a made up movie but play along. Um, so this is the big battle scene. I know here we've got some more props from various pirate movies. Pirates 2, they're the mermaid statue. And then over here we've got a few more pirate related props. From Waves, it's the Captain's Wheel. From Pirates, it's the Town Fountain. From Jailbreakers, it's the Sewer Jail Prop. And from Lockjaw's Revenge, it is Captain Lockjaw himself. Just there. And then this brings us into the end of the ride and back into the station. Where we will see you in the movies. So that is is the end scene pretty much complete the other thing that we've done is a few little touch-ups inside the station itself so we've added this new little back area um, mainly to block the view from the uh, station into the sort of behind the scenes uh, but also just to add a few extra props to the station um, from again various movies um, and we put them on these little little podium little pedestals just to uh, make it look a little bit better so that is the Battle Lot Tour pretty much complete. Um, off camera I'm going to do a little bit of touching up in terms of lighting and audio and things like that. So um, there will be a complete full POV coming soon. I'm not going to do it in this video. Um, like I said I've still got a few little finishing touches to do. Um, and also we've had quite a few comments and suggestions from you guys. So again thank you ever so much for your comments. Um, one of the things I have done is removed the helicopter that was going around this scene uh, it didn't really add to it and for realism sake it uh, made no sense so that's gone so thank you to whoever suggested that uh, and I'm going to do the same throughout the ride so any other comments you've got things you've noticed that you think look a bit wrong you think should be changed let me know I'll have another pass at it and we'll make some changes before we do the POV okay so moving on one other thing I've just done uh, I did this off camera because I didn't want to do it and bore you guys, so um, I've just done the interior of the studio store as well. So in here we've got a bit of the funky wallpaper from the uh, spooky pack. Uh, I found some random props and also made a few bits and pieces in here um, to make it look like a shop. Um, as, all, as we've still got before, these couple of real shops in there, so it actually is usable. Um, but generally, that is now our studio store. So, moving back to our entrance, um, we've done a little bit more detailing on these buildings uh, as part of our new main street. Uh, but generally now, that is about it for our back lot tram tour. So like I said guys, if you've got any suggestions or anything else you would like to see added or changed, let me know in the comments. Uh, and if you've liked this video, please drop us a like down below, it really does help us out. Um, as always guys, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel, stay up to date with all of our content, and there'll be more videos from our studio park coming very, very soon. Thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.